Here at Junior Motorsports, we take tradition to heart. And when we found out the number nine team wasn't allowed to kiss the bricks after Indy, we decided to take matters into our own hands. So we brought the tradition here. What does this mean to come here after so many tries and finally get a win, going out in retirement, especially against the Outlaws? Oh, no. Having that win. That's the crew from Camp Luck. They got a surprise field trip to Charlotte Motor Speedway to experience a VIP behind the scenes tour. We tagged along with Junior Motorsports fabricator and Camp Luck founder Wade Jackson and Xfinity driver Justin Algar to see what it was all about. It was an amazing day to say the least, so let's check it out. When we least expect it, life sets us up for a challenge to test our courage and willingness to change. Has this changed you at all? It definitely has. Okay, so you all know this tradition is getting harder and harder to pull off. After you've exhausted most of your resources, what else do you do? You never quit. That's what you do. We set up a fake TV interview with Dave Allen so we could sneak up behind him and douse him with super soakers. Stage racing is definitely the We say through here at Grace Harbor Raceway with tonight's A main feature winner, Donnie Shots, and a happy Donnie Shots at that. Congratulations, Donnie. You tied your all time win record in one season, which you did oh back in 07. Obviously, let my guard down. You let your guard down around here after winning Chicagoland? Come on, Jason, we're JRM 360. Did you really think we were gonna let you slide? The winning crew chief always gets wet, period. <laughs> I think that's better than a water gun. Everybody's gonna walk in, yay, cheer, you know, good job. Confetti, water, more confetti. We're here with tonight's A main feature winner, Paul McMahon. Final night of the racing season, world finals, huge race to win. You got second one year ago, one tonight. William Byron missed a win at Michigan by only inches, but the 19-year-old took that momentum onto the next week at Iowa and got his first NASCAR Xfinity Series win. The Junior Motorsports Constitution states that we are obligated by law to give the winning crew chief a water cooler bath. Now this tradition is getting harder and harder for us to pull off as the crew chiefs are on high alert after a win and expect to get wet. So we had to get a little creative with our delivery. Congratulations to William Byron and the number nine Exalted team on your Daytona win. Take that, Dave. Congratulations to the number nine team on your historical win at Indianapolis Motor Speedway and your third win of the season. Want to donate or volunteer with Camp Luck? Head over to CampLuck.com and click the Get Involved tab to see all the different ways you can help nurture the development of a lucky unlimited cardiac kid. Congratulations to Justin Allgaier and the number seven team on their second win of the season.